What up everyone? Welcome to Stack BMX Shops Instagram and YouTube channel. I'm Can't Stop LA. Today we're gonna do an explain and review about the 2021 Haro Slow Ride 29 inch complete bike. So like always, hang tight because later on in this video we're gonna tell you how to subscribe to our channel and like this video to win a free bicycle um, for yourself or for one of your friends. So hang tight because I'm gonna let you know how to do that. And later on in this video, we're gonna tell you where you can buy this bike and how you can pick it up before it's sold out. So uh, yeah, let's let's uh, check it out and uh, kind of tell you what I see about this bike and what the difference is and why it's priced at a certain range. Um, so starting off with the frame, uh, right away I see or kind of feel the same things is that a lot of people are saying, hey, what's up? Be what's up between this Haro Slow Ride and the Haro Pistol or the Group Group One RS One? Uh, the main difference, if you want to come in here and zoom in here, uh, the main difference is the fact that this frame just has the bottom gusset. So let me grab the other bike and I'll show you the difference. I'm going to cruise over and check out this head tube. This head tube has a wraparound gusset, so it's a little bit more, uh, more heavy duty, a little bit bigger bike. But overall, the frame is real similar, dropouts, almost all that other stuff. 6061 aluminum um, is pretty much the same thing. So, um, yeah, that's gonna be the main difference on the frame wise. Um, so we wanna kind of show you that because I was wondering the same thing once I started buying these bicycles. So I definitely wanted to show you guys that. So that's that's one thing. Um, come check out these graphics. I think these graphics are really, really sick. There's a little low rider uh, mini truck with the chop top, it's got, smoke coming out the back comes in this cool metallic purple it's got a little haro graphic right here some little pinstriping got some like old got some crazy font looks pretty dope kind of graffiti style looks looks pretty fire it's got a license plate on the front also up here and then it's got one on the seat that's pretty dope That thing on the bottom. So yeah, this bicycle is um, actually a three-way signature bicycle with the homie Brian Blyther. Um, shout out to the cop right there. So uh, miss you, homie. Uh, see, see, you, see you one day. We always run into each other. But uh, him, Mike Dominguez, and Xavier. Uh, so they just split it up. Uh, this is kind of their signature bike. Uh, pretty dope bike. It's nice light. Uh, if you're looking for a bike in a purple color, I think it's pretty dope. If you're looking one for your female, I think this is a perfect bicycle. Uh, let's kind of go through the, the bicycle from the front to the back and kind of tell you about that. We'll start at like the bars and then work our way back. So starting at the grips, um, it's got the same Haro grips as a Group RS1. It's also got the same uh, Haro 78 lever, same handlebars. Uh, these bikes, the bars are pretty dope. They kind of drop down, got their own uh, own style, which is pretty cool. It's got a high tensile steel 29 inch inch fork. Um, it's got the, the Cranium 2.2 tires. Um, this is another big thing that I noticed is a lot different from this one to the Group RS1 and why it changes the price point is mainly because these bearings here are unsealed and it's got a single wall alloy rim. It does have stainless steel spokes, but it's a little bit lower end wheel, but you could always upgrade and buy a purple or a gold set of wheels from us. We also sell the alloy wheel set. Um, so if you wanted the double wall, you wanted some steel, you can just upgrade and uh, change those out. But I noticed that's a big feature on that. Um, the same thing on the back, it also is uh, unsealed. But another thing that I noticed that this is different than the Group 1 RS1 is that on the other side, it's got the flip-flop hub. So you can run the smaller 13 tooth to you know, 15 tooth free wheel on this side. It's also got the three, it's axle, 17 tooth black free wheel. I think that's pretty cool being black. Uh, pretty fresh on there. So um, yeah, it's got that. And then let's run back up to the stem over here and then run our way down. So this got Saharo forged stem. It's got a like a machine top right here. So it kind of gives a little bit of shine. It's got the ratchet uh, top bolt on the fork. I think that's pretty dope. It's got the integrated uh, sealed headset right here. So it's got a large cap on it. So it takes up a lot of the space. I think that's pretty dope. And then uh, let's go towards the seat. Like I said, it's got the license plate seat seat uh, graphic on there. I think that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, big and plush. You see it real padded. Uh, it's got a steel seat post, 25-4, but you could always switch it out to a pivotal or a gutted, you know, I mean, a rail seat post, um, whatever you wanna do. And then let's go down to the cranks. Um, 
So these cranks are a 78 Hara three-piece chromoly crank. So it's got its 19, two, uh, 19 millimeter spindle, got the six millimeter pinch bolts and a spindle bolt. Uh, it's got a steel Haro sprocket on it. So a little bit more basic just to keep the price down. So I think that's cool. And then it's got the Haro recycled PC pedals. Um, I mean, obviously those are pretty dope. Uh, coming down to the chain, I know this has an S1 KMC chain. This KMC chain is pretty cool because it's got ramps on the inside now. So it runs a lot smoother on your teeth on your sprocket on the front and the back. Um, so I think that's pretty dope. Um, going to the back, it's got some pretty heavy DD texture style uh, brakes. These are a generic aluminum brake, but uh, on a complete bike, you probably want to switch out the brakes anyways, um, especially if you're doing wheelies and stuff like that. But overall for this price point of this bicycle, I think it's pretty reasonably priced. I think they did a good job of giving somebody a big bike for under 600 bucks. Um, so if you're looking for a big bike that's under 600 bucks, Definitely this would be one of the bicycles to pick up. But uh, dang, let me get this little bar pad on, this thing's tripping. All right, so yeah, that's pretty much for this bicycle. Like I said, 6061 aluminum frame, um, made to do wheelies, you know I mean? Stun on it, pretty much a big BMX bike for grown adults and stuff like that. And uh, uh, in our other video, check out the pist pistol video. Um, notice how if I drop this bike, hear that noise? Um, there's just a little washer right here. I want to let you know, I mean, show you guys if you're having a problem with that. There's a washer inside of here, and uh, it pretty much uh, is too too narrow. Uh, the bearings inside of here aren't pushed in all the way. Uh, just kind of a um, overlook at the warehouse, but it's making noise. I know last year's did this too. So if you're having that problem, all you got to do is pull the cranks off and uh, get a. a get a bearing press or you can get a rubber mallet or a plastic mallet and tap those bearings in. They just gotta go in just the hair. But once they go in, all that sound will go away. You can see in the pistol video, I did the same thing, didn't spend any money and it's it's super quiet. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for the Haro Slow Ride. So uh, yeah, if you wanna cop one of these, these bikes, hang tight, cause I'm gonna tell you where you can buy them and how to buy them. So I told you guys earlier, you guys can win a free bicycle from Stack BMX, all you gotta do is like this video, turn on your notification bells, uh, comment on this video, and subscribe to our channel. Let us know what you like about this video, what you don't like about this video. Um, anything that could help us out make some videos better. So yeah, just do that to enter, and at 5,000 subscribers, we're gonna give away a free bicycle retailed at 289.95 dollars to one of our subscribers. So uh, cool. If you're interested in buying this bike, um, this bike is available in the 29 inch. In the future, we might have the 26 and the 24, but at the moment, we only have the 29. So hang tight if you need those other sizes, but we will have these available on our website at 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time on the West Coast. Um, they'll also be available at our storefront at 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So tomorrow, come out, grab one of these bikes before somebody else does. We're gonna sell all these things real fast. So cop when you, when you can. So uh, yeah, that's our video for the Horror Slow Ride. Thanks a lot, have a good one.